Hey everybody, welcome to my latest video. Today I and I noticed that uh, there was a new roster for the college football revamped on uh, 12 26 or 12 30 in this of uh, 23 so December I missed it and, I, and there's a new place to get it on Operation Sports or a new part of the form so I'm going to show you guys how to install that and upgrade to the latest rosters in college football revamped on the PS3 emulator. There's also a link there to do it to PS3 itself. I'm not going to be able to show you that in this video, but I'll make a separate one later. I need to go and upgrade my PS3s. I actually got several of them. I do different things with them. I'm upgrading it, going to upgrade it, and I'll make a video on doing all that and post it here on the website. But anyway, we want to start by going to muttgeezer.com, which I will have linked down here. And up here on the uh, tab, you want to go to College Football Revamp tab and go down past my tutorials. And I have a spot here for the newest roster where I have that linked. If you need the PS3 roster, I have the newest one linked down here. And I have the old one from last year still linked here if you need to get the older one. But you want to click on newest roster. Open that up, it'll take you to Operation Sports. If I was you, if you don't have an account, I'd make one and make a login. This is a very good place to get things for all kinds of different games. I love this, this website, it's really good. If you wanna come down here to the uh, emulator, the RPCS3 file. The newest one was 1226.23. You wanna click that and download it. Here's where you need to be logged in. I'm already, already have an account. So, and I've already downloaded it. I'm gonna show you what that looks like now. So I've made a file called NCAA 14 rosters. You don't have to do that. I just do that so I know where I have everything at. So you'll get a zip file. It's uh, 12, 26, 23. Uh, RPCS3 zip that's for the emulator, and then you'll get this is the PlayStation one, so they're marked clearly. If you do download both of them, put them in the same folder, you'll know. So, if you want one for the PS3, it'll say PS3. So, these are actually two different files. This one's for the emulator, the RPCS3. This is what you'll get when you download for the emulator. And you'll unzip this, just unzip it in the same file if you make a file for it, or unzip it where you know where it's at. And you'll get this folder right here, 122623RPCS3. Very simple. When you open this, it gives you directions here on how to do it. I'm going to show you that, but if you're having troubles, read this notepad. You come in here, you go to save data, open this all the way up till you get to this file here, which is the uh, roster file. Now minimize that, go open your emulator, wherever you have your emulator at. I have mine here. You want to go to the dev HDD0, just like you do when you do the game, but you're going to go to a different place here. You're going to go to home. Open that, open this file here that's all the zeros in the one and you go to save data this will be where your roster files and your saved games and all that are at so you want to the one you just had unzipped the roster file right here you want to go ahead and copy and paste it or you can cut and paste it if you don't plan on keeping it i plan on keeping it so I have it. I have the emulator on several different computers doing different testing and simulations and stuff with them. So all you do is paste that in here. And then there's your roster. You see I have older rosters in here. Now you wanna go ahead, you don't need this anymore. You wanna go ahead and go back here and run your emulator. When you do, you want to go, it'll tell you on the website to uh, go 
to Nebraska's cornerback Tommy Hill and make sure he's an 83 overall to make sure that the file roster is correct. So that's what we'll do. So we're done on this website too. If you guys need any other th stuff on my website, it's all right here. I do have a video that got struck and taken down on how to put March Madness Legacy on here. If you want to do the NCAA 10 basketball, that's here too. And then I do have other downloads. Uh, here's the Discord and website for the mod for the NCA next. Very good 2006 mod. I recommend you follow them on Discord and everything. These guys are awesome. And then a PS2 one. I have linked to the PS2 emulator that you want to use for this mod. But they'll show you all that too. But the PS, you guys that can't run the PS3 emulator, you can run the PS2 emulator more than likely. It doesn't take that powerful of a computer, and that might be another option for you. All right, back to uh, what we're doing. Let's see, I haven't put this on the right screen. Go ahead and run the game. This will, there we go. I haven't booted this one for a while. <laughs> this is the one I use for my college, uh, my coach mode dynasty. I use a separate emulator for that. So I hadn't upgraded it for a while. Make sure I get the right controller here. All right, so we know we want to go into Nebraska and check. Go to team management, depth chart. Go to Nebraska. And then go up to corner. There he is, T. Hill, cornerback, 83 overall. Now, another team I like to check and see is Tennessee. We know they had a lot of young players playing the bowl game against my Hawkeyes. Uh, go to quarterback. You got the young kid. I can't even begin to pronounce his name, but he had a hell of a game against Iowa. He's in here. I mean, this is pretty cool. It's got the guys you want play the game with that's exactly how you do it if you guys want me to make one for the ps3 let me know i know a lot of you guys are still playing on that and i got some more stuff coming for that i've just been uh busting out a lot of stuff so i got a long list of things to get to like the dynasty tool that one's coming real soon that takes a little bit more time so i appreciate you guys watching the video hit that like and sub and yeah, I got memberships for as little as 99 cents a month if you want to help me out there. I appreciate you guys. Catch you on the next one.